dirt and rebuild this right here. Let's go ahead and um, fill that in. Fill that in. Fill that in. So really, we could go ahead and fill that in for just a moment. And do I have another? Let's go get another piece of glass. Keep everything good. For, for what reason? I don't really know. Just to have it. Just to have it. Okay. Now. So, that's where the lava's going to go. So really, these glass pieces are worthless. Um, okay. Do this. I'm going to have to have... I need... Where'd that sign go? I know I got it. Sign. Not eggs. Sign. should be it. That should do it. Now the baby chickens will stay in this little cauldron hopper cart area until they grow up. They'll hit that. That'll pass through there into the hopper which goes into the chest. So that's the plan. I guess what we can do is come back in a little, in a, a little while and check on it. Finish that off. Um, and eventually, what I want to do is, like I said, add more hoppers here and uh, carry that on to a chest somewhere. So that'd be cool. Um, what now? What do we do now? I don't know what we do. Is there any chickens in there? How do we know? I can't see them. Um, I don't even know if that thing's firing. There goes one. So I know there's chickens in there. I hear them now. Now you see them. There they go. Okay, good. There's chickens in there. Let's go ahead and put the rest of this, these eggs in there. Let them fire away. Now some chickens will die if they get hit too many times. That may be the reasoning for the double cart hoppers. Somehow it maybe protects the chickens or something. I know it keeps them from jumping because that was a problem with the original design. Is that all you had was a half slab on top of this hopper. And um, the chickens would just sit on the half slab until they grew up and hit the lava. But, and, but the problem is now with the dispenser throwing eggs, if it hits one of the chickens, the chicken would jump up and they'll burn up before they grow up. You know, they just jump up and down when they get hurt and then they'll jump right into the lava, which rendered that earlier design useless. So a guy came up with this and it seems to work. It seems to work pretty good. See the chickens in there, unharmed waiting to grow up to be horned. So, that's awesome. Alright, let's see if we can get out of here. Alright. Where's my dirt? We'll fill in this hole here. And... Oh, I wanted to do something else first. I wanted... Yeah, that would be alright. Uh, what am I doing? Jeez. I act like I don't even know how to... I've never played this game or something. Alright, I need some torches. So I just want to put down here to to keep um, bad guys from being in here. So that's going good. Alright, let's just uh, we're gonna fill this in. And... We'll fill it in. And um, we'll come back in a little while and check on things, see how it's doing. Do I want to do that? Not really. I would like to have an area I can come down here and maybe chill out if I need to. So we'll leave it open. I can't leave that one open. So we'll leave, let's see. 
Yeah, that goes all the way back. That goes all the way back. Yeah. Yeah. Just, sorry. We'll, uh, take that. Like that. This here. There yeah, we're talking. That looks good. Everything all symmetrical and lined up pretty good. This is gonna drive me nuts. I can't deal with this. Yeah, not gonna work. Have to figure out something else for that. But in the meantime, this is good. This is good the way it is. We'll leave it for now. And we'll come back and hopefully we'll have some chicken meat. Oh, let me check that. Stop throwing me eggs. I don't need your dang eggs anymore. What's in here? Alright, we got... I don't know how the raw chicken got in there, but we'll leave that. Just put those feathers back. Alright, I need some more ladder. That's the only way this is going to work. <laughs> oh, come on, get out. You can do it. Let me make some more ladder real quick. I had wood, that'd be a good thing to do, but I don't have wood. Give me some sticks. Oh, really? I'm gonna play that way, huh? I really am inefficient. Really? <laughs> Alright. Really? Get in me. Alright, so. Yeah, this is too tight for me. I don't like it. It's, it's just a little too nan -na for me. But I am glad that we now have a chicken farm. So I'll leave that like that. That way I can lean against that wall and it'll help me get up. So perfect. Perfect, perfect. This chicken's still dying back there. Look at all that. It's crazy. Let me sleep, would you? I need to go over there and get all that meat. Then I'll cook it. Then I'll, then I'll eat it. Okay. So our chicken farm is done. For the most part. Let's take this down. We don't need this anymore and the chicken will stop dying. So, let's see. You know, I wonder, I wonder what happens to stuff that falls through there, like, like, uh, if I were to throw this piece of dirt in there, well, I think a piece of dirt actually fell in there, let's see, did it pass through? Yes, it just passed through, so did raw meat, it's pretty cool, okay, so if anything, if you kill chickens up here, it all ought to end up in the, in the chest anyway, that'd be pretty cool. Just like these eggs. We can take these eggs. Um, take these eggs and just dump them in there. Yeah, see, it's throwing. That's cool. It's hitting other chickens and stuff. Sweet. Sweet, sweet, sweetness. So, I'm thinking the more chickens you have, the more eggs. meat you'll get, but right now, we have a lot of baby chickens in there that are going to probably grow up all near the same time, so, pretty cool, pretty cool, pretty cool, love it, let's cook some chicken, speaking of, and, let's go ahead and make some torches, we haven't had torches in a while. So yeah, that's good. Now, what I'm probably going to do is, uh, I may do it off camera since you've seen the mechanism I use for the dropper transport. Uh, I may just put a chest here. I don't know. I'll figure out something. I may just leave it like this until we get the barn done. Pink. Yeah, I may do that. Just hit some double building, building stuff. So, I'll probably just leave it like it is until we get the barn. But anywho, that is the chicken farm, and 
Let's take all this crap back. I'm going to keep this thing of lava here. Not here, but I'm going to keep it. You never know when they, we'll need lava again. So at least I'll have it. Trap door? Yeah, let's do a trap door. Trap door. Trap door. I got so much crap I don't know what to do with. I don't like full inventory. Sweet. I like this. I like this a lot. So let's go find something to keep us busy. Uh, we'll clean out this inventory. Let's take this back. We'll leave all that crap there. But yeah, this wall, need an idea. Need ideas big time. I thought about, also thought about building a mob dropper system. It's, you know, making the biggest part of it or the top part of it, like right in here, and having it drop down some way. Still may do that. I don't know. I'm gonna have to think about that one for a little bit. And really need to finish the inside of the house. Yep, gotta do that. I'm trying to come up with ideas for it. Uh oh, let's take some of this and combine it. Combine it quickly. Let's try this. I like doing that. That's cool right there. That function. Which I didn't even know about it until I was watching a older B00 video. He figured that one out for me. Uh, what else can we dump the wire? We got this. Oh, you're not supposed to be there. You're supposed to be there. Put that there. Okay. What do we got in here? All kinds of crap is what we got in here. Let's put the bucket there. Let's put the lava there. Let's put piston there. Raw meat. Dirt. I know where it goes. Wood. Wood. We know where the cobble goes. All that stuff. We can put these up there. Oh, got to put that back. Let's take this stuff. Throw that in there. Sweet. Alright, let's go back around front to the wood chest. The wood pieces, chest, stuff, thingy. Oh, we had ladder there. Haha. -ha. And trapdoor there. Yeah, we're not, not we're not with it. Okay. Um, let's see what else we're gonna do. We are hmm let's just throw some crap in here oh I forget should have put that over there should have put that up there too nope that I think we have a few levers that we could use if we need to don't you plenty 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 okay sweet I am so happy we got that chicken thing done how long did it take a baby chicken to mature ideas probably what three days something like that uh, something like three days I believe is what I remember reading or hearing about or something I don't know oh, we better eat something all right endless food Um, feathers, yes, get those in there. Glass, don't know glass there. Oh, I know where the glass is. This needs to go up here with that. Oh, I don't know if I showed you guys this. I was trying to enchant something. And I never could figure out why I was only getting lower level enchantments. Problem was, there was snow around here. Snow blocks the uh, bookcases from the enchantment table. So I added this little roof right here and that keeps the snow off of it which I'm glad I figured that out because I really need some really good enchanted tools why I don't know I don't do a whole lot of stuff with tools 
I actually needed them when I was doing that, um, when I was doing the, uh, clearing out the, the back wall there. Um, it would have been handy to have something to do. So anyway, okay, we are going to work on the house, definitely finish it up. I may do it off, off camera, probably going to do that. By now, I'm sure you guys have seen how to build couches and stuff. Um, but what I'm going to do is decorate the house off off camera, show it to you. I'll give you a tour of it, and uh, that'll be cool. We'll go from there. And barn. Let's talk about a barn. Where would be a good place to put the barn? Maybe I could build the barn up against this wall. That may not be bad. That may not be bad at all, actually. Or... That that piece that hangs off there... I keep thinking that is a thumbs up with a finger pointing. That's what it looks like to me. Anyway, just thought I'd mention that. So, or I could put the barn over here. I thought, it, since all the animals seem to hang out over here for some reason. I don't know why they do that, but they all seem to migrate toward this corner. Maybe I can build the barn over here. I don't know. I don't know. And I did experiment some with automatic cow cookers. The only problem I don't, the only problem I have with that is I like things to look sort of natural. And having a machine with a, a hundred cows stuck in one block area is not very natural. This, although water, you know, it's not really natural looking. It's a, it's a little more natural than throwing them all in one little, one little, one block area and having them, you know, be suffocating to death or something. I don't know. I don't know what I'm trying to say. Nothing yet. Um. Yeah, although not natural, it's more natural than what I was saying before. Having, you know, six cows stuck in a one block area hopping up and down. So, uh, and also, I, there were times before when I built this chicken on the old system before, you know, where you could just use a half slab under the lava. I would, I would put carpet. It's, okay, let's just say replace this water with hoppers, all leading to one hopper that drops down when the water would drop down, um, and covering the hoppers with green carpet. That was probably the most natural looking chicken farms I made. Um, it worked good, but it's very expensive with all the hoppers. I mean, I'd have to have, what, 25 hoppers just for this top area. So, it works well. It looks good. Eggs still get on the sides, though, even with the hop hoppers like that. But, um, I don't know. I think, I think it's been two days. Let's see, we got anything out here yet? No. Any chickens in here? Plenty of chickens in there, I'm sure. Which is the way I could tell. What if I do this? It says I'm looking at 29 entities. 28. One maybe. Oop. Maybe one died. I don't know. But anyway, pretty cool. Pretty cool. Just wait a few more, uh, another day or so, see what happens. Uh, what else, what else is there? I don't know, it's, we're coming along. We're getting to a point where we're probably going to have to do some mining soon. Uh, it's been a while since I've done that actually. Kind of am itching to do it. I really want to finish the house. And uh, I had to put these fences right here, by the way. Um, working, testing, <clears throat> excuse me, testing and working down by the chicken farm. Um, 
mobs kept I, for some reason I'd come back and the dirt would be untilled or unhoed and I'd have to rehoe it before I could plant again I think it's because things spawn and they with me being down there that far away but close enough if that makes sense um, things would spawn up here and they'd be running around and falling jumping off of this area and so I just put some fence right there to keep things from coming up there uh, we'll see how it works so anyway with that guys I guess I'm going to end this episode and when we get back the house will be decorated and we'll check the chicken farm and hopefully there'll be a bunch of chicken meat in there cooked chicken meat so we'll see how that goes and uh, by the way it is Thanksgiving and I'm recording this on Thanksgiving and I just want to wish everybody a happy Thanksgiving um, I'm very thankful for each and every one of you that watched these episodes this and my seven days to die series I appreciate it and I hope you guys have a good one